Uh, obviously a terrific win for us. Uh, I thought Ryder, um, and obviously our, our play in the first half was, was, was really good, you know, getting the big lead. But uh, when, when you play a team like Ryder with all those weapons, you know, you've got to be, you've got to be leery of their runs, and, and they made some. Our kids hung on. I thought it was a really good win. You know, they had won five of six and uh, gets us back to 500. Questions? Mike? Mitch, can you just comment on the game that Brandon had tonight, career high points and rebounds? It's the best game he's uh, played since he's been at Siena. I think he was really active. Um, his rebounding is to go 14 and 12. I, I did tell him, I thought before the game, that he could really play well in this game. They're not a big team. His size really bothered him. I thought he altered a lot of shots. Uh, oh, when you have two guys having double doubles, I mean, that's, that means you're dominated inside. What do you think of uh, Brandon being the point center and uh, leading the three on one fast break uh, match and scoring on it, by the way? I also, uh, I also had like a heart attack while it was going on. <laughs> it was a good play, but my heart was halfway down my, uh, my leg. <laughs> Mitch, I mean, the way you guys were attacking that their zone in the first half, I mean, that that had to be exactly what you wanted. I mean, you guys scored 47 points, and, you know, Odie was having his way. It just seemed like everything you guys were trying to get done in that first half, you guys did. Well, we had we had three days to prepare. We had uh, done a lot of study, and we studied their zone. They've been playing zone, and we identified where we thought the um, open areas were, and we, we exploited those areas. We got the ball of Odie in the middle and the baseline, we put a little wrinkle in where we were flashing to the middle. Um, you know, offensively in the first half, we were getting great looks. We were getting layups and wide open shots. Mitch, you guys are up 22 with 12 minutes left. Usually that's a pretty comfortable position, but under the circumstances, we were still kind of nervous because of the way Ryder can score, plus the foul trouble to Downey. And well, we, uh, you, know, you know, maybe we got a little bit. Um, you know, sometimes when you get a big lead with that, like that, you can lose your intensity. I, not that we lost our intensity. We gave them some wide open looks, you know, a couple of threes that got them back in the game. They did make ten threes. I thought the zone for most of the game was very, very good. Um, they made their threes and transition off our turnovers. Now, I thought we we did not turn the ball over in this game. I mean, we had only ten, and Downey and Poole were ten zero. So our passing pretty much all night was pretty good. They just they just made a run because they're a good team. They got a lot of weapons. When Downey fell to the three, you guys off a little bit, not having him on the floor. I think it did, Mark. I think we looked to him. Uh, he's he's obviously a senior. I think that did throw us off. We were playing with a lineup that I normally don't play with late. We didn't have the chemistry against the press. Um, that that certainly uh, I thought was part of the problem why we weren't executing as well. Mitch, you guys have played so well at home here. You win three in a row now. How do you have to carry that now out on the road uh, on Saturday? Well, we're playing a really good Manhattan team. Uh, I just found out they beat Iona. Uh, came back from 17 down. So uh, the little I've seen of Manhattan, they play really hard. They press a lot, and uh, it's going to be a very difficult game. I'm sure it's going to be a sellout. You know, they're drawing well. It's going to be tough atmosphere, and uh, we'll have to go in there and play really well. Anything else? Okay, one more. Sir. Rob had not been shooting free throws well this year, but were you reasonably confident in him uh, going to the line the last couple of minutes? Uh, that's because he's a shooter. Yeah, Mark, I mean, he's a good shooter. He's been practicing them. Uh, six of eight for a freshman in that environment is pretty good. You know, I thought um, I, I thought he made the ones that really sealed the game, so it's good for his confidence. Mitch, you guys now are, are 500 both in the league and overall. Is this a, a good achievement for this team, considering, you know, the hole that you guys kind of were in and now you've dug yourself out? Well, we've won you now five of six against some pretty good teams. I would say we're playing a lot better. You know, we still have a ways to go. There's a lot of league games left, and uh, hopefully we can continue to get better. I think the team has improved, and that's what I said was really important this year, that we get better, and I think we have. Phenomenal uh, first half, second half, that's a good team that came back. We withstood the run. We're back to 500. You guys have played terrific basketball. Let's go down to Manhattan and get this one. Let's come in. Let's go, Brian. Brandon, terrific. Rob, great job. Thank you. Good job. 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 Good job.